Guys, we are back. I am videotaping. We are doing, me and my buddy Tyler, three-day fishing tournament at Cold, Cold Lake. We are gonna slay it. Slay. But I'm gonna be stopping at uh, rigging jigs again. Guys, I got some suckers here. Kyle saved me some suckers. And we got some slabs, so we'll cut some up and use some hole. These are 12 to 14 inch suckers. Thanks, Kyle. And we are gonna do a giveaway for this Cold Lake tournament. And where do you got that here too? So this is the package here. Mm -hmm. We got some stuff from YYC Crankbaits, True Fishing Tackle, and then the Cold Lake Special. And how many people entered or what? So we've got, uh, to get into the draw, you had to buy a Cold Lake Special. There was 43 people that bought a bunch of Cold Lake Specials. Got them here in this bucket. Oh, good. They're numbered. So of course, bombs. Let's get rid of my bags here. There we go. Reach in, pull a number. All right, we have this one's blank. This one's blank. Oh, that's good. I'll grab another one. Forty-one. Forty-one. Colin Chartree. Looks like you won, Colin. So this is Kyle's other business. Robertson's plumbing and gas fitting. And then he's got rig and jig also connected to it. So guys, if you need tackle or bait, Kyle's your man in uh, Fort Sask here. And uh, next time I turn this on, hopefully I'll be on the water fishing. Hey guys, we are at the Cold Lake Derby. I am finally set up in the morning. We got one small one on the board. And we lost two. We almost got stuck on the way out here. We hit some flood water. It's not bad. A couple spots here. A couple spots there. You know. Just hit the four-wheel drive button. Put her to the ground and you're good. But we're all set up here. It's going to be a chill day. We're gonna relax. If we catch fish, great. If we don't, we are on the water. Ooh, with my friend Tyler. Say hello. Hello. <laughs> hello. <laughs> We're running some sucker belly. I'll show you guys here. Picked it up from rigging jigs. Some sucker bellies cut up. Slabs of sucker belly. Put that on your uh, tube jig, swim bait. My deadlines, I just have the bait laying on bottom. So now I get to relax and chill and wait for a bite. All right, I set the hook for Tyler. Yeah, he did. <laughs> I was scared for him. And uh, let him fight the fish because Tyler doesn't fish much. Better fish, eh? Yeah, this one's way better fighter. Yeah, let him. Yeah, right. So this is a tag, tag effort here. I set the hook and pass the rod off to my friend because he never gets the fish. Because <laughs> I'm terrible at what I do. But you know what? This is the game. Oh, Just a fun time. Oh yeah, that's a nice one. That's okay. a good size. Yeah, small one. Team effort on that one. We got the frostbite head spinner. That's fun, hey? There we go. Yay! A little snowy. Yay! Hold on, hold on. I, I went to video. There. There we go. Perfect. Go. Okay, yeah, let him go here. Hi, hey, buddy. Okay. Down the hole. Good job. Yay! <laughs> Guys, a lot of people want to know my deadline set up here for Lake Trout. It's just a cheap HT tip up. I drill this in so that it doesn't get pulled under. Open bale. Line pulls down to the clip, and when the fish pulls the line, clip goes up, flag goes up, and it's open bail so they could swim away with it. And uh, you know, 
that's the goal. Use a hole insulator here and uh, a little hole in the middle and you hope for the best. We have a flag. It had been tripped. Let's see if he's still on there. Something pulled it and went away again. Yeah, definitely dropped it again. Must be some small ones just kind of pecking away at it. That flag, the flag has gone off twice now. It's like these small ones just grabbing the bait and spitting it out. What do you think, Tyler? Agreed. Agreed. Slow guys, but we're here having fun trying to catch a big one. And that's how tournaments are. Really, you just need one bite. But we're not at work. And that's the key. <laughs> we are not at work. We'll try and get some footage here for you guys of something here. Slow. Tyler has one in the shack. Good job, Tyler. He's half asleep too. <laughs> Perfect. That's how you want to catch him. I always know when you're sleeping. So they bite the hook. Well, I just gotta wait for the bite. What do we got? A slab a slab of sucker belly on this one. There you go. Okay, see how it popped off? Yeah. Okay, now. Go ahead. Yep. Oh yeah. Oh, that happened. It digs into the ice, the braid. Oh, I see. Oh, neat. Yeah. Learning. How's my hair? Teaching my friend. <laughs> Everyone needs to learn. I need to learn more than once. Tyler is a master mechanic, not a master fisherman. It's, uh, I think it's one o'clock now. We've had a real big lull here. I talked to my friend uh, Barry and he hasn't caught anything either for a long time, so. Maybe, maybe I was sleeping for a while. Yeah. <laughs> that was a long line. <laughs> here he comes, just a little one. Yeah, little guy. Yeah. That's on though. Yeah, I'll get him because he is, it is bloated, so we're just going to get it back quick. Gotta help him down so he'll let them go fast when they haven't burped, so they have a chance to get down. But yeah, we got some action there, little guy. It ain't no 35 incher. Okay, hopefully we're hooked up. Just nice and easy, yep. Yeah. And open that side there. All right, my GoPro shut down on me, but we got a little baby here on the deadline. And so that's what's probably been picking away at our baits all morning or all day and we're not catching them. All right, well, go for some another one. Go for a big one. So it is probably 2.30. And then we have caught five, oh, about four or five small fish today. Massive. All babies. But Huge. Tyler brought some brisket. Uh -huh. and we're going to cook some brisket and have some salad. Finally got into probably a decent one here. This flag went up right after we were done cooking. And then, wasn't on, dropped it back down, picked it up again. Got a little bit loose drag here. I got the Vanford 2500 series reel with the Power Pro ice line. Great combination. Deadbolt, medium heavy rod. Fish has a little bit of potential. Can't let them burp there. It's good. About an eight pounder. Nothing crazy.
Just a little gapper. Go give him a length. He is 63 centimeters. Get him back. Just a little guy. Won't even register him. Bye bye. You want to pull that sonar transducer? Yeah. Okay. Sir? Yeah, there. Just watch yeah. there. Um, six years ago, me, Tyler, and Ben were out here. We caught two Lakers. One was 34 and one was 34 and a half, and that was Tyler's biggest fish. Big, big. You forgot about that I one. I did. Yeah, I had to go through my pictures there. I'm like, what are you talking about? Yeah. <laughs> this fish is getting close now. Hopefully it turns out to be a big, big mama. Oh, yeah. It's like a six, six, seven pounder. I can see it down there. I'm going to take my time, let them burp a bit here. And when they burp, they burp out the air. Yeah, here it is. Oh, yeah. It's definitely bigger than what we registered, so we could register oh, yeah. a little bit bigger one. We'll see. There's a typical cold lake lake trout. Just a uh, little well, one. We'll take a measurement. 64 centimeters. The bigger or smaller? Smaller. That's how it goes. Lots of mediums today and small ones. Do we have a decent one on here? I hope so. Oh, it's been a slow day. We haven't caught anything big. I'm hoping this fish is bigger. I was having a little nap inside the uh, shack and I looked over and my flag was up. Oh yeah, that's a nice one. Big one. Yeah, maybe a 30, what, a 30 inch. It's a better fish. So we gotta log into the app. Go into my catch, add a catch. Good. I think that's pretty good. Yeah, perfect. Okay, yep. Yeah. Add a hero shot. Okay. So take a picture of me. It looks good. Three, two, one, click. Add a release video. Just a small 28. Bye. I let that fish go on the app. I had to got a video of the release, so I'll probably try and crop that in on the video here. That fish was 20, just over 28 inches, so, you know, I'd like a 30 today. You know, in reality, I'd like a this big. 36, <laughs> but this big. it's fishing. There's no wind out here. We're catching fish. Some of them are getting bigger. We're having a good time. Okay guys, we are packing up day one. So tomorrow we're probably gonna hit the same spot. Guys, we're all set up day two. Um, currently I'm sitting in 48th spot. Some more relaxation and waiting for some dead baits. Do I got stuff on my face? <laughs> that's just your face. Oh, that's just my face. <laughs> but uh, I brought two propane tanks today and one, the valve on the top is seized. So a good thing I brought two, and then I have some spare one-pounders if we need, but it's a little bit colder today. But uh, hopefully I'm running next time this turns on to a flag. Monster shot. Is that a monster? Monster. At least two pounds. No one good. First fish of uh, day two. Yep. Here he comes. Oh, that's a nice one. Yep. Nothing crazy, but a good start to the day. 65 inches, I don't know about you. 
You're in the shack, you don't need your gloves on. I'm a baby, Sean. You're a baby. First uh, fish of the of day two. Yeah. All right. yeah, buddy. Okay, bye. Bye bye. All right, do it again. Well, good job, buddy. Well, that's not good at all. Wonder if this guy's still on. Yeah, it's still on. My first fish of the trip or of the day. Tyler is, is on the board with one. This one so far doesn't feel huge yet. Let's see what we got here. Another five pounder. That's all right. 23 inch. Baby. Tie game. Tie game. All right. Hooked up. Doesn't feel big yet. Really hasn't done much. Hoping for a bigger fish here. Oh yeah, that's a nice one. Colorful. 26. Brought him in the shack, just measured him just in case he was near 28, but bye bye. Sploosh. Sploosh. here 28 and a half so we'll give this one a measurement for the uh, tournament at a hero shot okay. uh, at a release video. Yep. well done Sean all right Did not catch a fish so I'm gonna try you're gonna break my shovel. Buy a new one. You're trying to make a windsock, eh? I'll show you a windsock. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, we got some deer sausage. I'll have to talk Nutella. No, you don't want Nutella to sell. We got salad. Delicious. And after the supper here, it's three o'clock. We're gonna hopefully catch a lake trout. Did it drop it? Another 28 incher. Right. Down so we get, get moving. Oh, I got splashed. Oh. Side, flag went up came inside here and this rod was pounding down feisty fish though might be a long one yeah looks good yeah. Easy. 
Yeah, there he's bubbling a bit. Lots of these uh, eight, six, six to eight pounders. I'm just letting them burp here a bit. Yeah. I doubt this one's very long. Just a little, little tiker. <laughs> Get him back here. Bye bye. Tyler, what's the update for today? Is there an update? While we're up. Tyler's update is Instagram. Uh, no. <laughs> TikTok. TikTok. <laughs> I'm too young for her. Too old for Instagram. I don't have Instagram. We're fogging up here. Fogging up here, guys. Okay. Probably caught 10 fish today. Yeah. Maybe 10 or 12. I don't know. And yesterday, maybe 12 or 14. Doesn't matter. We haven't caught anything that big yet. 29 inches is our biggest. I didn't get that one on video, but it wasn't a very big fish. It was long and skinny. So tomorrow is day three. We are packing up here soon and we're meeting our friend Barry tomorrow morning at uh, 6 30 in the morning and we are going to go to a different spot. Oh guys, we're all set up. Day three. Oh, there we go. Take note, you're snagged on the ice there. Yeah. So go underneath the ice. And reel. See it? You had popped there. You feel that? How it popped? Got it. Nice and easy, nice and easy. Yeah. Just take it easy now, nice and slow. Oh, that's a fat one. That's a fat oh, one. Wait. So bloated. You just bloated. You got a picture of them or what? <laughs> sure, why not? Just chuck him, put him down and just chuck his head first. Leeches all over him. Okay, trying to get our lines, trying to get our lines down here day three. Now uh, you can go back in the shack. Oh good, so it's bites crazy this morning, so we're gonna try and set up here and get a big one here. Well, I couldn't set up my second line there. And this one that Tyler caught on just went off. Feels good. We'll see what happens here. So we're just laying uh, dead bait on bottom. And uh, this one was a 10 inch sucker. Man, how many of these small ones are we gonna catch? Okay. Six pounds. Good. My friend Barry's over there. Transducer usually yeah. comes out first. Yeah, no, I, I like it. Oh, good stuff. That's a little gaffer. Little gaffer. Yeah, nice one there. Good job, Tyler. Pretty good. Get this one back. I got the propane just went out, so I'm gonna get this going. Yeah. I hope it's happening now. When this rod went off, and it's heavy. It's a, it's a big fish. Oh, nice. Like, definitely heavier than anything I've hooked. This, uh, this week. actually putting uh, 
putting up a good fight here. Oh. Oh no! Just get off or what? Yeah. Yeah, that was a big fish. Well, what do you say about that? Yeah, definitely gone. That's uh, two and a half days I was waiting for that bite. When I set the hook on that fish, it stopped me dead in my tracks. Pulled out about 30 yards of line. And then we got the GoPro running. Well. I don't know what to say. <laughs> a lot of curse words. <laughs> yeah, that was a big fish. Oh, Sorry. flag's up. Oh. Never off. I got the bale open on these so they can take line. Yeah, 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 yeah. There you go. He must have been on there for a while. Beauty. Yeah, that one's fine. But definitely not heavy. It's coming up here. Here's the mono. Here's the weight. It's a small fish. Yeah, hooks out. Just using single barbless. I'm defeated, you guys. <laughs> Absolutely defeated. I gotta get that other rod set up. Okay, well, fish are feeding. Let's just keep going. It is what it is. Well, bait was still there, hooks were still there. Set it back up. See if we can get a another bite. We got about two hours left. Guys, we're closing it up here. Crazy day today. Probably sitting in 45th spot with that near 30 incher. Um, biggest fish of this tournament so far is a 35.2 incher and there's a bunch of 34s. So we would have had to really catch a big fish to place. But, but yeah, we're done packing up here. I'm going to eat the last bit of my sandwich and... Thanks for watching you guys and uh, hope you guys enjoyed some of the footage I got and the chaos and the excitement ups, ups and downs of ups and downs of fishing. Bye bye.